This is your CBS News Baltimore afternoon update for Wednesday, August 23rd. I'm Nikki Zizaza. The BGE gas regulator saga continues, but this time CHAP is stopping BGE in their tracks. The commission voted Tuesday to stop BGE from installing outdoor gas regulators. But if a homeowner wants one, then BGE needs their consent to do so. While homeowners say they can be easily tampered with, BGE continues to say they were designed to keep residents safe in case of an emergency. A Hartford County community will come together for a remembrance ceremony this Sunday in honor of Rachel Morin. Metro Crime Stoppers is now offering a $2,000 reward in her murder. Hartford County police are still searching for the suspect. Warren's body was found along the Mon Pa Trail in Bel Air a little over two weeks ago. Sunday's remembrance ceremony will be at Greater Grace Church of Baltimore. Police believe this is the prime suspect. He is also tied to another crime across the country in Los Angeles back in March. A special email address has been set up for tips in the case. It's rmtips at hartfordsheriff.org. A former Cecil County Sheriff's deputy is now charged with revenge porn and misconduct. 28-year-old Kyle Thomas is accused of taking an explicit video of himself while on duty and sending it to a woman. When the woman notified the sheriff's office, Thomas allegedly contacted the victim's workplace and filed criminal charges against her. Those charges were dismissed. In a separate incident with a different woman, Thomas allegedly took photos and videos of sexual acts with the woman without her consent and sent them to dozens of social media users. And that's your afternoon update. For CBS News Baltimore, I'm Nikki Zizaza.